is an advantage, especially when you're an underdog. And the opening run goes to the freshman Devin Neal as we take him been learning on the fly, no doubt. A pass on second down is complete. And this is Trevor Wilson, the wide receiver, a transfer. Bean out of the shotgun, gives it to Neal, and the extra effort gets him close to the 35, and the mark is going to leave him the screen. They go quick, and this is Neal hit at the line of scrimmage, and the spot will dictate whether he got it or not. Going to run on first down. Bean keeps it this time and gets a yard and a half over the right. Wilson in motion. They run the ball on second down. This is Neal. And he steps through a couple of tackles and takes it out across the 40-yard line. It'll set up another third this time on third down. Kansas read the ball, ran the ball, came up short. And here they'll lose yardage back to the 40. That was Neal toting it left. K-State record, four in a game. Here's Bean on first down, completes to Arnold. And after a heavy dose of those eight games of the year, Bean rolling out on second down and three, going deep, and he's going for a man that's wide open. That's Trevor Wilson, the transfer from Buffalo. He came over to Kansas with the coaching staff, and he has impressed. Quick pitch here to Lachlan on the left side, gets a few on first down. That's what he's doing, and here it goes again. Just over top of Arnold there, incomplete. We'll set up Bean running left. He's going to keep it, and he is going to get nailed. That was Daniel Green who got him. There is a flat green on Bean. I mean, this is how you go. That's exactly how you draw it up when you're teaching a kid in Little League to tackle. They fake the handoff to Neal. Bean rolling and throwing, and this one's incomplete. And another flag for a third concept and 10 near the 40-yard line. Neal gets the carry left side. Not much doing there. McPherson, one of those. This is Neal again. Hit behind the line of scrimmage. And he'll end up going the wrong direction. Athlete he is. Bean on third down. Under pressure again. He's going to run. He's got room. Sliding down at the 25-yard line. Last time they were down this way, settled for a field goal on first down. Neal churning forward. Lachlan went down. He's out with injury. And that's where they'll go here. A pickup of three on the play. Should set up about third down. And it will be. Looking left, throwing deep. This is Arnold and incomplete. Nice coverage by Boydo. Most of your opportunities. And a little trickeration here. The flip to Wilson on the end around. He didn't get much. With Bean, second down and eight for the Jayhawks. Quick throw right side. McBride, the intended receiver. But this one, Bean to throw on third and eight. Here comes pressure. That's Green that runs him out of there. And it's batted down. Great play defensive. Stakes hasn't had a whole bunch of opportunities since, but he's back in. And they'll run the ball on first down and probably a smart way to start it. On first down, they'll run it again. And a nifty move in the hole by Pesek Hickson. On the hands of the quarterback, who's a good runner. And they run it again with 23, Pesek Hickson. And I don't think he got back. Trailing 21-3. Fumble on the play. And Pesek Hickson. Running back has to clear the ball. They try to throw, and a fumble, and another sack, and it'll be Kansas State. Fifth forced fumble. Had a couple last week. And they run the ball with Neal on third and 16. We'll see if Case Long for Vaughn. Kansas comes out throwing in the second half, and short hop to Lassiter incomplete. Down yeah. here, this can really help do something for their confidence. Unfortunately, they didn't get in the end zone. A missed field goal. Get her the way Kansas wants to set up shop offensively. Daniels under pressure, dumps it off to Neal, and he'll be well short of the first down and a punting of his career and the youngest freshman uh, to hit one for K-State. He, he did. He needs to try to get comfortable in this game. Daniels looking to pass on second down. He's got Lassiter open across. They'll run the ball again with Neal. Goes down close. Daniels again. And one more time, he is complete. Yeah, without question. 
They run it with Neal. Makes a man miss. Picks up a couple after nearly going down in the... Jalen Daniels to hand Neal. And this time he goes inside the four here and pick up the pace. Neal again on third and two, and he lost a little bit from the school record. They pick it up. Pass is caught. That's Lassiter who breaks a tackle, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas. Daniels in at quarterback, hands the ball to Neal, who's got running room out across the 35 and picks up a... And, and done well and really matured in the season. Touchdown pass on the last drive. Completion here for Daniels. And this... Find Lasseter here. He's down close to the 45-yard line. Expect the play, but he's been called upon, and he's been sharp. Well, you, you got to make the most of your opportunity, and here's something we've not seen today. Daniels running. Looked like he, he wanted to... So if that's something he can do, and he did, I think he might have gotten a guy on the... On the field, too, right? A little Aaron Rodgers there where he gets a guy running off the field. <laughs> Ball snap. A great hustle by Nate Matlack. And look at this. I mean, he, he is absolutely I'm right out of the corner of your screen there. Boom. Good job by Neil to try to stay up. But wow. Kind of a quiet guy. Now that he's starting every game, his attitude has really changed. Yeah, absolutely. More outspoken, more. But they get a little extra yards because of the penalty. Throwing toward the end zone and knocked That's away nicely. Really good defender. Really deep. defender can find it. Good job by Bordeaux. Second and ten. Daniels completes. Lasseter. He's a talented player for sure. Third and six Jayhawks. Ball tipped and this one going to be trailing 35-10. Kansas goes on fourth and six. Quick pass to Neal. He stretches for the marker 